Nice and out of tune at the end there. You can't beat a bit of Jeff Beck. <clears throat> Evening, folks. How you doing? Hope you're doing well. In case you don't know who I am, my name is Steve Forward. Cockney guy from Essex, England. Who uh, loves his classic rock and loves playing guitar. And um, over the last, since lockdown, just tie my hair out of the way. Since lockdown, um, like most musicians, I've been wondering what the hell am I going to do because there's no gigs. Um, and so I've been sitting um, the last year making videos on YouTube uh, with just a phone. Um, and then it's sort of, sort of, um, developed into earlier this year, March, into sort of live streaming on YouTube, um, but just to my family and friends and, and people who come and see me at gigs, not publicly. It was, uh, July that I started publicly streaming, July of this year, to, uh, YouTube, and then kind of November. I started streaming to Twitch. Um, uh, begin, as I'd say the second week in November, and now it's that's about the second week in December, a month, four weeks later, and I've just got my affiliate today. Um, as usual, they're kicking their heels and taking, taking a few days to sort things out. But um, the milestone was actually achieving the hours and getting, the hour and getting people to do that. Most of it wasn't anything to do with me most of it was to do with people that helped me along the way um and um just people who like what i do and have, and and, have, and it's it's definitely taught me um something about twitch that, that you know i had a, such an incredibly tough first time when i went on twitch and uh, that story will come out sooner or later um, but for now, um, it's kind of like I had a second, second life with it all really. Um, and, um, you know, Cred Feto and Mark really has sort of, uh, helped me along the way, get, get things sorted out and, um, making sure that, um, I'm not. You know, doing trying to do the right things and stuff, uh, and uh, I'm going to get things wrong as I go along. I'm going to get loads of things wrong. Uh, that's just that's just part and parcel of live streaming. I'm afraid there's nothing you can do about that. Um, but this is my humble studio. This is where I spend most of my time, um, and this jam and chat I've wanted to do for a long time. I've seen most people sitting down and playing. And I wanted I wanted a nice clean layout, and I wanted to do everything that was on hand here. I didn't have to. Most of the time, you see me performing on that little stage area there. I call that the stream stage area. Um, most of the time, you see me perform there, and then other times, like today, like tonight, this is the first one I've done on here. I did one of these last month on YouTube. And I did one of these. This is the first time I've done it tonight on here, and I'm hoping to sort of do plenty more of these as well. It's just a case of me jamming. I'm going to be jamming some classic rock uh, cover tunes, jamming some original tunes, and um, all the while, you know, um, I'm just going to put some of my music on in the background. Let's just lightly along in the background. There you go. <clears throat> and. Um, as I say, all the while I've had help from people, uh, and and uh, like today I did another stream, and today I smashed the affiliate requirements, um, and I smashed 100 followers, which was great. Um, but what I was initially looking for was I was looking for people who were doing a similar thing to me, and the only guy that I found who was doing anything similar was Pete Northcote, uh, who, who. Um, what I mean by similar is I mean someone who's actually who can actually play a guitar, um, and and and, um, and has his shit together, you know. And, uh, and and it didn't take me long to find Pete. And then I thought, well, I won't bug him too much. I just, uh, but I mean, 
what I was really looking for uh, was to see can it be done, can can it be done well on Twitch? Are there people out there doing it well? And Mark suggested a couple of other people. Well, Mark said, oh, well, I follow this guy, I follow this guy, check out this guy. And um, and so I found Kenny's Prog Rock Jukebox and the Jukesters, which I think are absolutely hilarious. I think those guys are the funniest um, people I've seen on Twitch. It's not a pint of vodka. It's been a long day. And... Um, Hey, Steve, at work, so going to be doing a lurk and listen. Have a great stream. Thank you so much. I live in a cake. I think that is the best username ever. People have usernames like Galactic Warrior. I just have Steve Forward, but I think that is the best one. I live in a, <laughs> I live in a cake. Just, you win, you know. Thanks so much for sticking around. Thanks so much for saying hello. You know, I'm all on my own here. Got seven people lurking. What the hell is that? It's a new, all these new terms I've got to learn. What is a lurk? What is a lurker? Someone that just sits and doesn't chat. What's the point of that? <laughs> Thank you. Feel free to call me Cake, though. Fantastic. I will. I will. So you just missed me jamming to some Jeff Beck. Uh, and this is, a, this is kind of a similar thing to what I did on uh, YouTube last month. This is the first time on Twitch that I've done this. And I've got three different uh, shows that I'm planning to do on Twitch. This is the third one. Um, the second one is the Classic Rock. Well, four, it's four shows, sorry. I feel, like, I feel like Monty Python there. The first show is my original uh, iMod for Pete and for Marta. I had come to come and see I heard. It sounded great. Thank you. Um, there's other shows that I do. My original one, where I stand up there and it's full production and everything. And I stand there. There's another one called One Floyd, where I do all Pink Floyd. Um, thank you. Uh, Jude Laurie. Hi, Steve. One of Pete's Twitch coats here. Congrats on your affiliate. Thank you so much indeed. Um, I've got 104 followers. I can't believe it. I mean, I started four weeks ago. And it's mainly because of people like Pete giving me shouts out. And as I say, when I started, and for Marta, he's great. I've watched his streams, and he's great. And today I did a stream and Twitch went down completely. Um, the, um, the the Twitch chat completely collapsed. And I didn't know who to raid when I finished my stream or anything. I didn't know what to do. Hi, <laughs> Cake. Okay, you're called Cake. Okay, great. This is superb. And, I, and I've been looking, as I say, the four shows. So the other one is like a Pink Floyd tribute called One Floyd. And then a, a Steve Ford guitarist where I do just stand up and play classic rock covers with uh, the videos and things like that from my After Hours subscription show. And then the third one is um, the, uh, the original Steve Ford Live and then, and then this one where it's just very informal and more chatting than... I mean, yeah, Twitch was a butt earlier. Yeah, that happens far too often. I don't know what goes wrong with it. I'm... I'm I mean, I'm not used to that. I mean, usually YouTube's pretty good, and I'm, I'm very, 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 very strange why it does that. Um, let me bring up a tune. Let me let me see what else I've got in the pantry here of uh, of tunes, and see if I can jam jam something out. Um, because I, I don't want I want to keep it sort of nice and uh, mellow. Uh, let's do a bit of Henry Mancini. Also. Just have fun with it, mate. Go nuts with the music. Yeah, I will, yeah. Um, as I say, I've got my serious shows, my serious sort of arty show-offy shows that I do, and but this one is really laid back. I've, I I hate that when people just come in, they've just seen this one. It's like, no, no, I can do more. It's all right, but... Um, <laughs> but yeah, this is, this is the, uh, the very, very informal one. Um, if I want to sort of uh, keep my watch hours up and connect with people on here quickly, I can just hop on here, set up a couple of webcams, and it, and away I go. Um, so let me just try this one out. Let's have let's have a go. This is a this was uh, you know my my mum my uh, passed away in 2017, and um, it didn't go down very well, obviously, because I'm a, I'm a youngest 
Uh, I was her baby, and uh, my mum, my mum passed away in 2017. She had um, she had Parkinson's disease, and uh, she had a massive stroke. And um, well, my mum always loved this song. She always loved um, Henry Mancini. She always loved Moon River. Um, and I and I've always wanted to do a kind of a Jeff Beck thing with it. So I always put this in at my gigs. I always put this in at my shows. And my 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 uh, the Steve Ford guitarist covers i can't keep them on um uh i can't keep them on oh, yeah sorry i'm oh, sorry thank you for your kind that's okay no problem uh it was five years ago now and it's but it's still you know every november it still gets a little bit my birthday's in november and my mum's birthday was in november as well so um never gets easier does it when you lose loved ones and but my dad is still around my dad he's 80 and and He's an army man, and he's going to outlive all of us. And he's got—he's a right character, and he loves Queen. And at the moment, I'm working on Bohemian Rhapsody. I'm working on all the vocals. I've done all the vocals, completely recorded the, you know, um, Bismillah, no, and all that stuff. I've done recreated all that because I want to put it in the um, the Steve Ford Rock Covers show that I do, and After Hours for the subscribers. Um, but my mum loved Henry Mancini and she loved uh, Moon River. Um, so I'm going to try. I'm going to try and see if I can play this. Let's see if we sort this out. I'm using some crappy plug in here. This guitar. Right here we go. Let's have a look. Let me try and work this out. Let's go. Let's go. Let's try this one. Nice, as we English people would say. <laughs> nice. And, uh, yeah, she loved that number. She really loved that number. She used to sing it to me as a kid as well. So it has a real, has a real impact, you know. Um, and um, my dad's still knocking around, so you've got to be grateful of the people that are, you know, that are still around. Anyway, I'm going to liven it up. Very nice. <laughs> Is that a thing on Twitch? Can I, I can speak to you. I can speak freely here. Um, is that a thing, noise, then? I don't know. I'm so new. I really am. Five of you on there. I'm going to tune up my guitar, and then I'm going to play another song, another Jeff Beck, I think. Let's, um, let's bring up... Um, let's get the, something like the pump going. Should have tuned it up at the start. I'm a little bit out. I changed all these strings last week. 
In Australia it is. Oh, nice. Of oh, course. Cool. Now, I've got a friend. I taught a guy. He lives in Perth. And when he lived in London, I taught him for about six years guitar. When I lived in London. Steve Cartledge, his name is. A lovely guy. Really nice guy. Communication behavior change it works in. Be as you say. And um, him and his wife moved out to Australia. His wife passed away. And he's a lovely fella. And he lives in Perth. And um, he's a Yorkshire man. And he's quite a character. But he's a really nice guy. And um, my dad goes out. Has been out to New Zealand and Australia a few times over the years. We were hoping to go out. But lockdown. You know what I mean? What can you do? <laughs> um, let me, uh, let's bring up this. Let's do something rocky. Let's just, I don't want to bring the mood down. Let's do the pump. Let's see if we can do the pump. Here we go. <laughs>
I'm being a bit of Jeff Beck. Super duper duper. Yeah, um, would like to go to Australia one day. Be, be nice. Be nice, as they say. So your Thursday, I've got some lessons. <clears throat> got guitar lessons. Thank you, Jude Laurie. Thank you very much for your kind comment. Thank you very much indeed. And um, Friday, it's got a mind of its own. Friday, I'm going to be planning on doing a, a proper stream. This is a new one I've been doing. This is a new backing track. Um, I had to do this for a client, actually, about ooh, a year ago. And I thought... Well, I made the track. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use it myself. Star is born. Shallow. I'm gonna see if I can remember it. Let me tune. I've just put a fresh set of strings on this, so you guys are not gonna be happy with me. I'm gonna to have to tune up again. So, what is the weather doing over there? Because it is freezing. I've got a heater. If you can see just there, I've got a little artificial heater log thing in the studio here. It is bonkers. Good. That is a version of this. Most of these, most of these um, songs that I'm covering um, are on YouTube as produced things, um, especially the pump because you've ended as lovers. The first two I just played, and this one. Um, Grey having a dull summer. I can't believe it. Really. That is so crazy. That is so crazy. Unbelievable. If I get this wrong, if I get this song wrong, everyone's going to unfollow me and the whole world's going to be a disaster. <laughs> Should we try it? Here we go.
I do enjoy that one. Tuck Shop David Madden. Hey, was doing a drive-by. Sounds good. I'll be back. Don't forget to check out a few other shows. Good day from Sydney, Twitch Coats. Hey, you'll come over from Pete. I hope that I'm not encroaching on Pete's stream. Um, because I'll stop streaming. I would hate that to do that. I would really hate to be... Um, I'm not aware of the times and what he's doing. So, um, oh, thank you very much, Jude Laurie. Thank you. Um, let me, I just want to go and check to see if Pete is streaming. If he is, um, hey, Steve from Pete too. Uh, oh, hi guys. Handsome Dave. Thank you so much. Um, I literally just thought Karen just, my wife just, my wife just went to bed and I thought I'd, um, not streaming tonight at nine. Oh, thank God for that. Right. Okay, cool. I can relax. Good day. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but whenever I sit hear an Australian talk, I want to start talking like an Australian as well, but it's really bad. I do a really bad impression of it, because I talk like that, all right, geezer, you know, like a proper cockney. And um, I tell you what, it's so nice, I'm usually standing up, leaping about, well, leaping about with all the cameras going, and this, this uh, stream is more, much more informal, where I'm just sitting down, chatting, jamming and just like you know hanging out and just saying everybody and um we've got a few here already thank you and um so if you've if you've ever seen my streams before you'll know they're not like this at all i like to stand up and sing and perform and play and but this one's more laid back right um let's have a check and see what is going on in my channel because I want to see who is on and say hello. I'm hoping my mod is going to be there as well. So Sega Dream, I've got to look at these, the Jukesters, Tuck Shop David Madden, all these people lurking that won't say hello. That's so crazy. Capoco. Lurks, Jude, Jude, Lor Lor Jude Laurie, sorry, Jude Laurie, I lived in a cake, cake, I know cake, we've introduced each other, me and, me and cake know each other now, cake, and um, I'm going to tell you a story off the record here, just for you seven guys here, um, when I started in September of this year watching Twitch streams, I was chatting to a streamer who I really liked, this is, a, this is, uh, you were a lot of fun on Pete's pop quiz the other day. Oh, thank you very much. Um, and that's, that's true about Sade. I live in a little town called Clacton-on-Sea, right near the sea. It's on the seafront, and there's a pier, Clacton Pier, and it's quite a, it's quite a run-down seaside resort. They used to have a Butlins in the 50s and all that here. And Sade, the singer Sade, she comes from here. And just up the road in Tottenham, about an hour away, Adele comes from here as well. But Adele talks like that as well, doesn't she? So I tried to speak a little bit posh, but I can't help it every now and again. But uh, anyway, um, this is a true story. And um, I was following the person on um, Twitch, loving what they were doing. I was so impressed. I was a little bit blown away. I was really impressed. Bought all his albums. Bought all his albums. I hope, is, uh, is Pete... Northcote here, he can hit, I want him to hear this. This is a really true story. This, is, this really happened in September. Bought all his albums, threw loads of bits, endless bits. I mean, it must have endless bits at him. Uh, and then one week I woke up to find my money had been refunded and I'd been blocked. Um, I, I'd been blocked from twi Twitter and I'd been banned permanently from his chat. I'd done nothing wrong. Absolutely. I, I'd be the first person to say, hey, I've done something wrong. Now, I know I can be a little bit overexcitable sometimes, but that really ruined my experience of, um, uh, and he's, he's well known as well. And anyway, a little bit of gossip here. I knew some of the mods, some of the people that were in there. So I missed, so I whispered them and I said, what the hell's going on? And they went, oh, he's done it to you too, has he? And I wasn't the only one, so, but I, I nearly gave up streaming and completely for good because of that because of that guy 
because uh, and I think it's awful. So I really watch. I'm really, I'm really careful when everyone's like, "Oh, don't, don't say that, don't." And I'm really careful about what I say because I had such a bad experience with it all. Right. Well, if Pete's on, I, I mean, uh, goodness gracious, how do you live up to that man? Well, I'll tell you what I like about Pete. I'll tell you what I like about him, and I tell this to my wife Karen. I tell this to everyone I meet. He plays the guitar properly. Yeah, he don't. He, I mean, we can all sit there and go. <laughs> And sweet pick and all that stuff. He plays properly. He plays like that. He's got a nice lyrical quality. He plays like a proper classic rock guitarist. He plays like a session guy. And I like people like that. He love it when I say that, but I genuinely mean that. Genuinely, I don't. I don't warm to a few people. Um, he could probably he could probably bang on about all the people who he's played with, but um, when I was you know in my twenties, there's a there's a drummer from Judas Priest called Les Binks, and I played with him loads. I know him really well, and Tony Parsons from Early Iron Maiden, from the Early Iron Maiden days. He lives up in Harlow now, and uh, oh okay, no problem. Yeah, Pete's great, um, and I know I'm speaking to all the Twitch codes here, but. I'd say that anyway, he is. And I like Kenny as well. Kenny's Prog Rock Jukebox. And I like um, the Jukesters as well. I think they're great fun. And, you know. So, yeah, it really soured my experience. But I'm, I'm so... When I, when I saw Pete and he was doing all his cameras and, and everything like that, and I was just like, I'm done. I cracked, literally cracked open a beer, put my feet up on the sofa. I've got a sofa here. I, I just had him on that. I thought, I'm done. I'm so done. I love him. And then and Tanti as well. Lovely. So there you go. I've told everyone how great he is. I'm going to jam some doors. I don't know whether I'm going to do some doors or I'm going to jam some dire straits. Sultans of Swing, Brothers in Arms. I think Brothers in Arms, maybe. I love that song. These are all my own backing tracks that I use when I usually sing or play. But I'm just going to, not going to sing. I'm just going to jam over them. I want to turn this down a little bit. Let's change the camera scene. What's he saying die for?
the sun's gone to hell So many different suns Straits. I do like a bit of Dire Straits. My party piece is Tunnel of Love. Tunnel of Love and the um, Dire and Sultans of Swing, the party. may do those later on. But I do love a bit of Dire Straits. You worried me there, Dave. Oh, you're very kind. You're very kind. Check out my other shows. I do classic rock shows where I stand up. And there's all music videos that I've made to them. And I do a Pink Floyd one as well. But I can't keep them on. I can't keep them as VODs on Twitch because I'll get done for copyright. But my original music is all up there, you know, and uh, on my YouTube as well. But this one is really laid back. If this is the first time you see me, I'm kind of a little bit, kind of a little bit crap because um, I'm kind of just sitting down like this, vegging out. <laughs> I had a long day, you know. So, um, but thank you. Very kind comments. I really appreciate that. Thank you. Anyone that sits and watches me play. Much appreciated. Are you handsome, Dave? Are you handsome? People call me Handsome Steve for a joke. But um, are you handsome, Dave? I bet you are. <clears throat> Unfortunately, I wasn't blessed with looks. <laughs> or talent. <laughs> uh, but... Uh... <laughs> 
but we move, we soldier on. You do what you know. You play the hand. He's very handsome. Of course. Well, of course you are. Of course you are. Hence the nickname. And it's not ironic then, you know. <laughs> so great. We do a bit of Jimmy. This is a bit of all on the watchtower. I'm not going to sing this one either, but I am going to just change effects on here. I miss my wire pedal. It's over there. I can't be asked to get it. Oh, you are very kind. I'll take my hat off to people that can play any instrument. Thank you for sharing your talent. Thank you for watching. Um, as I say, I don't have a schedule because I fits in around what my, my day job is, is I write um, backing tracks um, for the cruise ships for a living. That's what I do. My studio here is pretty crazy. Not as crazy as Pete's, but it's crazy. And um, so, I, you know, I can, I can play a bit of piano and, and things like that. Um, you know, where's my piano? I, this is the, I love this tune. Here we go. Listen, I mean, you know, let me try and be try and be hip and trendy. I know it sounds funny, but I just can't stand the pain. Girl, I'm leaving you tomorrow It seems to me, girl, you know I've done all I can You see, I've been stolen up by road Yeah Ooh, That's why I'm easy Like something more yeah. And what's the other one? That's it, yeah, then there he goes. Yeah, I I I, I when I started off, uh, when I started off playing music, I started off on piano. Piano's my first instrument. Um, and then I switched to drums, and then I switched to guitar. So uh, yeah, so all the backing tracks you hear are done by me. Uh, I mean, it takes twice as long to do everything. Anyway, back to the plot, because I could play piano all day. Thank you. A bit of Jimmy, a bit of Jimmy. Let's rock out here. I'm gonna rock out here. I'm gonna make sure. I'll make sure I get everything I need. Good. Got a bit of a delay. Nice. Cool. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's have some fun. Whoa, look out.
See you on here, Dippy. How you doing? Have you all come over from Pete's lot? He'll be mad. I don't listen. Don't tell him you were here. All good, mate. You were sounding awesome as always. You're very kind. This is uh, any Jimmy Vaughan. Hey, I can do. I can do Pride and Joy or something if you want. If you want to do some Texas Shuffle Blue stuff, I can do that if you want. It's just a case of finding the backing track, or I could say it in an Aussie accent. It's just a case of finding the backing track, man. That's the worst Australian accent I've ever done. That is bad. I should stop doing that. Right. There yeah, I could find something like that. Let's find... Uh, let's find... I'll tell you what. Let's find Little Wing. Let's do the Stevie Ray Vaughan version of Little Wing. Let's find that. Because that that's a lovely, lovely tune to do. Um, and then I've, got, I've got a few others on here. There's some more Jeff Beck that I want to do. Here it is. It's Jeff, just Jeff Beck's little, little Wing. Here we go. <clears throat> that, was, that was totally FK, Steve. <laughs> That's the whole point. That's the whole point. Because I talk like a London geezer. All right, mate. Um, but um, so this is like the chat and jam sort of thing where I'm just like, like the chat lounge. We just hang out and just play a few tunes. And it's not like it was before, like when I've, you know, got all the cameras flying about and I'm standing up acting like a rock star. This is more, way more informal. And I wanted to, I wanted to do a, a stream every now and again, just like this, where I can chat to people and, you know, throw out requests, keep it really lighthearted and stuff. I made affiliate today, by the way. Um, I managed to, um, <clears throat> managed to get that happening. I was quite pleased. I love your, uh, Dippy says, I love your accent, mate. That's the attraction. Your axemanship is average. Thank you. I get by, you know. <clears throat> I'll tell you a story. When I was, I was teaching at the um, Guitar Institute in the 90s, because um, I'm 45 now, I'm an old boy. <laughs> it's all right, you couldn't offend me. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I'd, I'd learnt this piece. I'd learnt, like, you know, I'd learnt, like... <laughs> I'd like this really big Steve Vai P and I'd work this all this technical stuff. Like, I don't know how to play all this. And I did it in front of the examiner. And he had quite an he had quite a sense of humour and he said to me, Well, I hear there's good money to be made down on the docks doing favours for sailors. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, nearly made me blub like a good one. Here's a bit of Jimi Hendrix, and I'm going to try and dig out um, Pride. I'm going to try and bring out um, Pride and Joy, Steve Ray Vaughan. But in the meantime, I'm going to do I'm going to do a bit of Hendrix, okay? A bit of Little Wing. This is this is really laid back. This is nice. Here we go. <laughs>
you gotta be careful of. I'm gonna share your stream to my Facebook page. Can I just see you on there? Yeah, sure, you do what you like, yeah. It's public on Twitch, so share away. Um, you just said, suggest you put up a follow button on your stream in the familiar spot so everyone can follow you. Hello, Tampa Bay Rabbit. Good evening. Uh, if you've just joined me and you've seen me before, you're probably thinking, what the hell is going on? He usually does streams where there's cameras flying about and he's standing up and it's all properly. And I'm, and it, well, I, I, I'm still doing that. But I wanted to add another show where it's just jamming and chatting away. Uh, and it's all laid back and easy. So, you know, so people like Dippy can follow me and um, make requests and things, you know. <laughs> I am, of course, joking. I love all of you. And as I just say, I'm a big fan of Pete's. I live in, we are all, we all bow to his immense talents. And uh, he said to me the other day, I'm 61, you know. I said, shut up, you're not 61. He went, no, I am. No, he's not. He, he could pass for 58 any day. I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> you are, what's that? You are dimensional. I'm 67. No, you're not. You can't be. With a name like Dippy. I bet you don't. Send me a photo. Are you, I'm on his Discord. Send me a photo of, 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 you, of what you look like. Go on. <laughs> I'll publish it in Lonely Hearts. <laughs> Dear Australian residents, have you seen this man? <laughs> what a handsome man he is. <laughs> like this. Dear Lonely Hearts, I'm looking for a romantic lover. Wow, 69 Tampa Bay Rabbit. Happy birthday. Would you like happy birthday? Sixty-nine is no age; it is but a number. I'm sixty-seven. Okay, bitch. <laughs> in the water, pulling a tube in the Shire. I don't know what that means. I've obviously said something wrong there. Terry, you're the first guy I've come across on Twitch older than me. Wow. Okay. I'm gonna switch sounds. Every Christmas, I usually play this. You can find this on YouTube, me doing this, but this is, um, I usually play White Christmas. This is, this was one of the first jazz pieces I ever played. Pleasure, Tampa Bay Rabbit. trouble again Dippy what are you doing I'm gonna ask why do they call you Dippy ah uh, look at that always 
Tampa Bay Rabbit says, LOL, no worries. I'm uh, all resolved. I thought, don't kick off on my stream, please. Oh, don't. I'm new. What am I going to do? My mod is in bed. <laughs> my mod is asleep. In fact, where is he? I'm going to wake him up. I'm going to message him. Just put, I'm live. Help. Help me. <laughs> now let's jam to along a, um, <laughs> I'm going to jam along to a bit of uh, Eric Clapton now. Uh, this is I Shot the Sheriff. And I, this is the... Now, I saw Clapton in 1997 um, in Hyde Park. And um, they did this version. So I'm going to play it now.
I do like a good jam of that. And I saw I saw that Clapton do that in '97. Um, stunning performance, absolutely stunning. And the Who were playing that day as well. Now I'm going to read out all your messages. Thank you so much, Jude Laurie. Awesome, Steve. Uh, now, Dippy, I've I, I seen that you like to been writing poetry. Okay, let's read all these out. Dippy says, because my last name is De Pena, Rensch Portuguese from five generations ago, it was bastardized to Deppy, then Dippy. I even write my poetry under my pen name, Dip, and have been Dip since five. Tampa Bay Rabbit, woot, jamming. Yeah, that's what this is all about. It's not about singing and... Um, I can do pretty much any song you want um, if I've got the backing track for it. So I'm going to see if I can find Layla. Because um, I say I just set this up about three hours ago and I went, I'm doing it. I'm going live. So um, but um, let's read out what you're saying. Because I want, I, want, um, I want to read out what Dippy's saying. I've been writing poetry for 10 years, Steve. I'd picked up a pen in anger. Before that, I've written over 6, 5,300 poems. Since then, self-published a book of poems in 2013 and did my own one-man show reciting my poetry in 2019. Good for you. Well done. And that's not patronising. The show was partially videoed, but my mate ran out of battery, so I only caught 50 minutes of my two-hour show. It's raw, unrehearsed, but from the heart. If you Google an audience with Dip and Friends, you can watch it. I will. Tampa Bay Rabbit, wowza, thank you. And then Dippy goes on, like you, I'm new to this platform, Twitch, but I'm totally amazed at the talent around the world. You are totally awesome, and your humility is your attraction. I, I'm always, I don't consider myself any, anything different or um, outstanding to every other person on the planet. Um, I believe that that is one of the biggest misnomers of the world, uh, that you assume that you're better or uh, something like that. Now. You do need a certain amount of good. I believe there's good ego and bad ego. Good ego means that you, you do need a certain amount of good ego to get up and perform. Like you recite poetry in front of people. You need a good amount of ego to say, hey, this is me. This is what I do and entertain and try and hold an audience or something. That's what's called good ego. Bad ego is where you think your shit doesn't stink and you think you're the best thing since sliced bread and everything else. We all know what bad ego is like. We all met plenty of them people, right? <laughs> um, so, yes. Like you on new at this platform, humility is your... Incidentally, I've started my own poetry page on Discord called To Serve With Love. Everyone, everyone, I say 10 people that are watching, go onto Discord and find To Serve With Love. Thank you, Jude Laurie. Uh, awesome, Steve. Thank you. It's all my own rights, which I'm revisiting where appropriate and adding choruses. Cannot sing or play a note. Did people leave me watching this? Oh, What's going on? What's happened here? I'm not starting Gary Newman's cars. No, I'm not doing that. What's... <laughs> he wants Layla. If I do, if I do Layla, uh, now I'm not, I'm, I am newly an affiliate, which means that I don't, I, I can only get donations. Um, and that is, um, why have I not got, you put the follow on there, why have I not got how to donate on my page? Uh, I usually do on all my other streams. That's why this is so new today. This is so new. I'm going to have to do it live on the stream. Can you believe that? This is so unprofessional. But if you go to Streamlabs, you don't have to. Don't worry. Um, I'm just going to type it out. I'm going to do it right now. If you go here, you can, you can drop, a, drop some coinage. Whatever you want to do. I don't care. If you don't, no problem at all. No problem at all. Um, I won't, I won't, wait a minute, it's all gone, the screen's gone all mental. Now, this is what I don't like about these informal things. Bear with me, people, you, you very tolerant people. There you go, I'm going to put this in the corner down here. There, if you go there, and it'll come up, I've got an alert box, and it'll pop up. 
here. It'll pop up in the corner. Right, 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 right just above where it says uh, Streamlabs. There. And on the other on the other page, let me let me stick that on there as well. Let me let me um, let me copy that. It's going to go dark. We're going to go dark. London has gone dark. We're going to go dark. Bear with me, guys. Because I'm going to take that off, and now that's going to be on every scene now. There you go. Oh, it would have to be somewhere different, wouldn't it? Eh? For God's sake. You can't make it up. I saw, and now those that know me, those that know me know that I'm a big Kylie Minogue fan, believe it or not. A massive... I've got her calendar on the wall. And there's an album I did called Strange Kind of Life that I wrote about Carly Minogue. And um, it's called Strange... The album on YouTube is called Strange Kind of Life and the track is called Make My Day. I have PayPal, everything like that. You go to my website, steveforward.com. Um, this is the one thing. You know what? I have all that sorted out. I have PayPal and everything. Bear with me, guys. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make sure this doesn't happen again because I'm usually on it. You see, I've got the alerts, but I haven't got the bloody thing sorted out. I don't believe it. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna add to this, and uh, you can go to steveforward.com, and you can go to donate as well, and forward slash donate. But I, I'm gonna take off the www. You don't need it. Okay, and there's the two um there's the two things. I'm just gonna switch them round, folks. So sorry about this. This is really unprofessional. Anyone that's seen my streams before will know that I don't like this sort of stuff. I'm not a fan. I like to just but hey. But yeah, anyway, so I'm gonna play the track, right? And it's about Kylie Minogue. Okay. Uh and it's off an album. It's the only rock vocal album I ever done. Um called um uh, strange kind of life and um i'm gonna jam it now um it's this is one of my um don't freak the show must go on <laughs> indeed um let me just let me copy this to the next one as well can i highlight it yeah they'll come up they'll come up dippy yeah no worries um they'll come up on the screen there's the alert, the alert. i've got the alert box all set up don't panic They'll all come up. They'll flash up in the in the top part or the bottom part of the screen, wherever. They'll either flash up the top part or the bottom part. They'll come up on the screen, uh, and you'll you'll be on your leaderboard there in the left hand corner. Don't worry as well. Right, hang on a minute. Let me put that. Down here. Dooby dooby doo. I'm not a fan of this stuff. Ever since lockdown, I've always been a live guy playing live on my own or with bands. And um, there you go. And it's down there as well. Okay, so we've got two of them there. Right. Now I'm going to find Layla. Because. I think that's going to be in the L drive on my Steve PC. So let's just go there and go to the L. When lockdown happened, I made a backup of all my tracks. So um, let me just see if I've got Layla. You're in luck. All oh, the full seven minute version. Dippy. What are you doing, Dippy? Thank you so much indeed. That is very, very kind of you. Very, very kind. And if you've seen if you've seen my one Floyd show or anything else or any of my cover shows, then you'll know that I'm not like this normally. You know it's a little bit better. Let me turn the heater down and do Layla. You've been asking for Layla. Thank you so much, Dippy. You're at the top there. Very, very kind of you. Very kind. Let's, 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 let's just um, move Layla into, um, into the folder that I've got for this um, informal chat and jam thing. Because um, I 
I like this. This is fun. Wow. Here we go. Layla. Well, last time I played Layla was with a function bow. I was doing a wedding. And the bass player... <laughs> I think I've led a, led a charmed life to watch this. And the bass player got, got off with the, uh, with the singer's sister at the gig. That's one of the more pleasant gig stories that I have over the years. I'm going to croak my way through this one. I'm not going to sing it. I'm going to jam it, though. This is the full seven-minute version for you, Dippy. Thank you very much indeed. That is far too kind, far too generous, considering the stream didn't even have an alert on it. That's shocking. Here we go. Let's just go. All good, man. Wow. <laughs>
That's for you, Dippy. I haven't played that one in years. Years. I'm so glad you like it. I've never heard anyone play the full length. Thank you. Oh, you're very kind, Dippy. Thank you. Thank you very much indeed. Now, where was I? Now, there's a song called Make My Day. Seven Minutes of Joy. Thanks, Steve. Good request, Dippy. Thank you very much. Thank you so much indeed. This song... <laughs> Hopefully this song will make you laugh. Hopefully. Um, this song is about Kylie Minogue. I like Kylie Minogue. I don't like her music much. I don't mind it. I don't mind it, but I like Kylie Minogue. It's a running joke. I have a, I have a calendar on a wall and everything else. It's, a very, it's, a, it's well known. It's a, it's a running thing. And I'm going to play along to this song anyway. This is called Make My Day. And uh, you, can, you can listen to this on my, on my YouTube. Um, Steve Ford UK. She has a nice bottom. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like abracadabra. I was, I was, playing, I was trying to play. La, 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 la. You know? My best mate, the thing for Carly. I think, oh, yeah, well, I still do. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Well known. Anyway, let's, let's listen to this. Let's, uh, let's, let's just jam along this track. Here we go. Have a bit of fun. There you go. Great fun. That album was a lot of fun to do. And um, I 
There's quite a few albums on there, quite a few tracks on there that are quite good. So anyway, let me get a couple more covers, and uh, I'm going to do something like uh, I do a uh, now Moody Blues. She, I wish she, I wish she could hear it. She'd probably like it. Um, you know, where I got the riff from the idea. Uh, Find you on cannibals. Good thing you've been gone too long. That shuffly groove, you know. You know. Uh... <laughs> You know, great fun. I'm gonna um, I'm gonna do an instrumental. I do. I normally do this um, on my sets, on my classic rock sets, and my real world gigs. And there's a version of this on YouTube that you can watch. Um, I was kind of saying, thanks to you playing. No, I, I now I don't. They were trying to draw out. I don't have, I don't have any fine young cannibal backing tracks or anything like that. I'm so sorry. Um, but I, yeah, I can I can play pretty much anything I need to. But anyway, so uh, but I don't mean to be funny like that. Like you know, don't mean to be funny. Well, we know each other now, so you know. This is Nights in White Satin. Now, the in this is an interesting story. Um, Justin Hayward um, from the Moody Blues, as we as you guys all know. Um, Kieran Hayward got in touch with me to say that he really liked this version because his uncle is um, Justin Hayward. And um, I, know I, I thought it was a wind-up. I thought he was having me on. But, um, yeah, as you say, nothing wrong with a healthy ego, and I mean that in the nicest. No, no, I, I just mean that I've, like, I've been playing for 25-plus for <laughs> years. I've, I've turned professional when I was uh, 15, 16 started making money playing and uh whilst I was at college. Um so you know, I just thought I'll oh, that's what I wanna do. I just love playing music. That's what I wanna do. And it's a hard road but um I really love it so and when you love it um yeah I'm forty five. I was born in nineteen seventy five. Uh <laughs> so um yeah. So anyway, this is this is Nights in White Satin. Um but this is the instrumental version that Kieran Hayward um enjoyed from the Moody Blues. So here we go. He could be me dad. He could be Struth. <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you very much. Hello, guys. Twitch coach for you. And don't tell Pete. I'm worried. You guys are all from Pete. I'm worried. <laughs> Thank you so much, Tampa Bay Rabbit. Really kind. Dippy, I heard it was showering, just been lurking. Have some time. Steve, I want to be your Australian agent. <laughs> Have you seen this guitarist? <laughs> You need to bloody book him now. <laughs> yeah, I don't care. That's okay. Pete's on tonight. Thank you. Oh, oh, you know. Let me tune this up. Let me tune this lolly stick up. It's awful guitar. Thank you so much for all your kind comments. Very, very kind of you. I, I just literally was expecting to just come on and me and Mark were just going to tweak a few bits and um you know you know how you do something and you know um wish there was a way to share this yeah you can you can share it you can share it underneath the um underneath the stream there's a little um thing there's a little arrow pointing up thank you dippy it was great on the quiz thank you there's a little arrow pointing up called share and you can click it and you can share it if you want. But after the, um, yeah, thanks, Dippy. Thank you for sharing that. But after the stream's finished, I don't, I'm not going to keep it on because I'm doing covers. So uh, I, I unpublish it. But I, um, it's, uh, yeah, 3.27 a.m. here. Yeah. I would normally be up working, as I say, um, one, of my, one of my jobs as a musician, the music producer, is to, to make backing tracks for the cruise ships um for disney and for the cruise ships and all the places like that it's not as glam as it sounds i've just dropped the disney bomb like that saying i work work for disney but i don't work actually work for them i work for the companies that they work for and um they usually say things like can you do a five minute medley of 50s rock and roll songs and here's the track and i remake it and things like that and so i'll usually be up working anyway and it's getting near christmas and the guy said to me um rick said to me i'm out on the ship at the moment i haven't got the drums done for this rolling stones track um and um and so don't worry so i thought well i'm not doing anything else so let's let's just just jam for a bit um you know but as i say i do i do other shows as well the other shows that i do uh are not as um They're not as uh, informal. Ah, thank you, uh, um, Mazrix is now following. Thank you so much indeed. Very kind of you. Um, thank you for the follow. And welcome to uh, my little world, which is um, full of guitar and classic rock and instrumental rock and original instrumental rock. And uh, if you love guitar playing, then hopefully you should enjoy yourself here. Okay, and this is one of the, um, as I say, that uh, this is one of the shows that I put out. I put out uh, on Twitch and YouTube, I put about four shows, different, different things out. Um, this is covers, instrumental jamming covers and stuff. And the one Floyd one that I do is all Pink Floyd. 
and that's got all the videos. Um, Steve, was that your own voice on the car? Yes, it was. Yeah, I'm, I'm, uh, that is me singing. And when I, when I do the classic rock numbers, I, I sing as well, as well. So you can um, see me singing on YouTube and stuff. I'm not a great singer. I'm the first person to hold my hands up and say I'm no Freddie Mercury. You know what I mean? I'm no. But it's, I'm kind of like I've always had to. Oh, thank you, Dippy. But uh, that's very kind of you to say. I've always had to be the singer. Um, if we've had a bass player and a drummer, I've always had to be the singer in the band because um, no one else would do it. So I kind of do it because I have to. But I've, you know, I've worked with some really amazing singers, amazing singers um, over the years. So you know, nice to sort of, it's nice to sort of take a back burner. Can I do Robin Ford? I used to do Help the Poor. Robin Ford, I used to do Help the Poor years ago. I don't have a track for it, I'm afraid. Um, but that's the the solo in that. It's lovely, isn't it? It's when it goes. Uh, uh, are you guys up? Are you guys up for like uh, S, S, uh, Stevie Ray Vaughan or something? Shall I shall I bring up Pride and Joy? Because somebody asked me to do that a minute ago. Pride and joy. Well, you heard about love, things without ever mind. That one. My baby loves me till the end of time. She's my sweet little thing. Steve Perry. Wow. Journey. Um, that's the. Uh, that one, isn't it? Blimey. I won't be able to. Just a small time girl. That's a little bit high for me. There's a, uh... um, I do. I play keys. I play piano as well, but only, only, only as a, a sort of a an afterthought. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm the, the first instrument I did was piano, so um, it's like. She packed my bags last night, pre-flight. Zero hour, 9 a.m. And I'm gonna be high as a kite by then. Kenny, uh, Kenny doesn't know I play piano. I won't tell him. He's brilliant, isn't he? He's he's absolutely brilliant. He's like he does all that stuff like the stride technique and everything, you know. I have one day I'll one day I'll sit down at the piano and I'll go. Mama just killed a man, put a gun against his head. Pull my trigger now, he's dead. Mama, life has just begun. But now I'm gonna throw it all away. Mama, ooh, I don't wanna die. Sometimes we shot down. Here we go. Wait a minute, let me find the track. My computer tells me off if I get it wrong. Now I've got to find Stevie Ray Vaughan, uh, so just bear with me, guys. That's going to be in the. Um, in the K folder. Pride and Joy, Stevie Ray Vaughan. Wow. Found it. You're in luck. I have it, guys. Well, you thought about my baby loved me till the end of time. She my sweet little thing. Let's turn off this reverb. We got to get a. a... Got to turn off all this junk. Hang on.
Let's try it. Badly played. Sorry, guys. It's been a long while since I've played any SRV. What's the other one? The uh... stuff. Do I play any Aussie stuff? I'm going to get in trouble here. Do I play any Aussie stuff? Um, do you mean like rock stuff? Thank you, Tampa Bay Rabbit. Thank you so kind of you. ACDC. I can play ACDC. You want me to play ACDC? 
Okay. Wow. Let There Be Rock. Why not? I sing and play that one. I'll, I'll, next time I do my uh, rock cover show, look out for me in the schedule. Oh, Crowded House. No, I don't. In excess. But I do, I do know it. Uh, uh, let me just try and find some ACDC. And then I'm going to have to leave it there, I think. But let me find it, and I shall deliver. Let me go to my... I thought it was going to be all laid back tonight. All nice chilled out numbers. And everyone comes on. Yeah, ACDC, man. Everyone's, everyone's like, you know. I'll tell you what. There's four ACDC songs there. Alice Cooper. Bad Green with the Beatles. Black Sabbath. And, oh. Go and see my set list. I've got loads of stuff. Loads of stuff in there. Cream. Cult. Let's just put some. I'll tell you what. Let me do. You shoot me all night long. I love that song. Let's do. You shoot me all night long. Great, 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 great album. Let's just drag this. In. Let me just drag this in. That's me mucking about. Hang on a minute. Right. Boom. With her legs around my waist and arms around. <laughs> What's going on? I got my air guitar out. You should me. Oh, thank you so much, guys. We were all singing. Thank you, handsome Dave. She was a fast machine. Yes, she was a fast machine. She kept a motor clean. Oh, yeah. Guys, I'm going to have to love you and leave you, but we're, I'm going to see if I can, we'll see if we can raid someone that's good. Let's, uh, let's raid Chris Davis, I think. He's pretty good. Um, Tone Zone presents Chris Davis. Let's see what he's like. Let's see what he's up to. I want to check him out before we do anything like naughty like Raid. What's he do? He's heavy. He's heavy. Ultraviolet Riot. Um, and Lee. Not many people I know are on. I'm going to raid him. I'm going to raid, let's just try to try Ultraviolet Riot, hang on, this is pump, Pop Punk, J-Rock, Sick Tunes, Power Metal, Metalcore, 
Wow, let's do that. Twitch's very own colourful guitar, which let's go there. Guys, I want to thank you. Handsome Dave, Tuck Shop, David Madden, Tampa Bay Rabbit, uh, and Dippy, most of all, Dippy, bless your heart. Thank you. All of you, thank you. Thank you very much indeed for just sticking around and making me feel so welcome. Uh, you know, uh, don't forget to check out my other shows, which are more. Um, uh, thank Jude, thank you, Jude and Masrix. Thank you till we meet again. Um, just hit that follow button and uh, don't forget to, uh, you know, um, do the usual things, follow and stuff. And I'll be back with uh, some different shows again as we do as we normally do. Okay. Uh, thanks for the birthday song and music. My pleasure. No problem at all. Let's go back to my channel and we are going to raid. Um, here we go. Thank you so much, everybody. Give my regards to Pete and I'll try. I'm going to get some sleep now and uh, I'm going to try and uh, raid this, 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 this fantastic guitar player over there. Come check her out. Thank you so much, guys. Really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Yes, my plan worked. I got her. What is happening today? Steve! Steve Forward! We got a shout out for Steve Forward. Thank you for the raid. How are you? How was your stream? I got one question for you guys. Raiders, I have one question for you. I have one question. Do you like anime? What were you playing? Uh, since you were playing music, were you playing Rocksmith too, or were you like doing something else? Remind me, I'm just going to follow you so that I uh, don't forget. Cause I sometimes I forget if I like don't. Pro guitarist, hell yeah, yo, Steven, that's sick. Someday I hope to be a pro guitarist. Rock covers, chat, and jam, hang out. Yo, that's awesome. Well, I followed you. Hopefully, I'll be able to stop in sometime, check out what you do. Um, if there's anything you would like to request, we have a tradition where raiders get to request a song. We bump.